again. Also, how come only three characters exist in this world and we're never shown any other um, any other characters in this whole world? And they have three castles and they're literally a like satyr like elf creature. A cheetah. I oh, need a head bash. Great work, asshole. Fucking hell. Thanks. It does laugh. It's taken him this whole time to teach us this, and you have to go back through several levels in the first and second world. What an ass. Ah, I thought it was worth a try. Just gonna be doing it to everything now. Oh, we're killing penguins. I'm sorry. The game rules that I have to. So yeah, I like this area. It's got like, obviously it's got the hardest levels in the game. Money bags is everywhere, charging you for everything. So you better be fucking good at the game, the levels you unlock. Cause it's an asshole. Oh no. Actually, it's the professor probably saying, "You ain't got enough orbs. Fuck off." job I was playing the game. Ow. <laughs> so I can go to Cloud Temples. Uh, already had Mystic something. Mystic Minia? Mystic Marsh. I think we can break that rock open wide open. Good if I stop fucking up for a second. Oh, there was literally a fucking orb just in that rock. It was a big rock. Remember this kind of thing? Remember how there's a level in the second world where we're now going to have to go all the way back just for one chest that's like that? So yeah, we never got to do the retro speedway because the game literally was refusing to let us do it in the last part, wasn't it? So we could go back and do that, or we could just do this. I mean, I want to show it at some point, and I'll probably forget by the end of this game, but... I have 24. Damn it. So you suddenly see how they're like, yeah, I know. Rub it in much. You see how the game is now like, no, fuck you, you should have been getting the mini game orbs. And then it gets to the final mega grandiose portal over here. And it's like, get every, get every orb in the game, fuck you, it won't start otherwise. And you're like, Hey, Robotica Farms, I remember you. It's a fun level. Steep ass steps, man. I ripped to climb these fucking things. Let's see what this idiot has to say. Remind me again how you can afford three castles. You literally have a leaf dress. Oh, and you need 40 orbs just to open the door. Beat the game in general. Jeez, that's gonna be a long... I forgot you had to do that for the final boss. So yeah, this is Winter Tundra. It's, it's a thing. It exists. I don't know where they got the other fucking orbs and shit. Let's have a look. 
Oh, if you're too lazy to climb the stairs, great. Sorry, did I see you? I did not. Ah. Ah. Hello, friend. Oh, we can open that other portal now. You can get all the baseline levels in this area, but they, you know, you start to see the progression blocking, ramping up a little bit here now. Where it's like, nah, you know, you skipped a load of orbs and you didn't do the base shit and all the shit. You notice how the speedway levels also are literally just gems. So it's like you don't even have to do them to beat the main game. They really demoted the flight levels, man. Because they knew, they knew that nobody liked them. But also, to fair play to the game, or perhaps signs that it knew at this point that everybody was going to be pretty pissed off when they say, hey, 40 orbs, and they have 20. In this area, they just give you orbs. I just picked up two that were just around in rocks or on the side, so it's like, you know... Oh. Let me get these first. So yeah, it's not exactly... It's over here. There's an orb over there, too. Oh, money bags is here, so you know, it's gonna be a... We can afford that. Unless he's like, free grand. No deal. So speedway is not worth anything. Especially if you're not 200, you get only about like five, 600 from them. So how do we get that thing, you might ask? Good question, I would say, because I have no fucking clue. So we're gonna try. Using our brains and geography. was my attempt. I didn't say I was proud of my attempt. Maybe it's in here. Oh, it's Cloud Temple. Oh. I can't remember Cloud Temple, but it feels like a name I will remember the moment I go into it, so... Let's go and unlock this other level and see what name it is. It might ring a bell, and, uh... There was one in a fucking rock, mate. <laughs> like... I feel like you guys could have found that. Metropolis. I don't remember Metropolis, but I'm sure it's nice. Uh, let's go do Mystic Marsh. I don't remember Mystic Marsh, I just think that that's level one of this area, so... You know me, and my annoying mind goblins that I only vaguely adhere to. I was listening to a podcast once and someone said, like, Compulsions are essentially little rules you invent for yourselves that you follow forever and ever and ever and never drop. And are obsessively going, no, I have to do this forever and ever and ever now, and I will follow the stupid mind game I've given myself. I kind of remember this. Oh, I remember this now. This is not fun. Elephant snails. Game gets weird. As we talked about the giant hippo things, there's now elephant snails. The hippos with wings that can eat cherries and get big. Probably ripped her. It's also rhino snails. Wow. Wow. Okay. 
Oh. Really? Okay. Jeez, you guys are assholes on here. just go in, don't they? Combo there. Again, very weird, but like, I like the weirdness. What if there's rhinos, but there's snails? level of the day. Getting real tired. thing under here. We go ahead and assume I can't hit these guys when they're puffed. Well a platypus puff a fish. the duck. You can't hurt the ducks. Okay. Sorry, that was the line, apparently. Oh wait, I could get up there, I think. Oh, great. Glad I can platform. Damn it, here we go with the cancelling shit. Need to kill one more thing. The blood gods. Oh, there's loads of shit up here. Great. Game. Give me go in the game. Yeah, 
of these levels. I'm gonna go ahead and say winter tundras don't fuck around. Some of them are pretty fun and they get real strange and we'll see that soon, like this. But, uh... Yeah, but, you know, there's a whole other area up there, man. Oh, the parrot was just to spring you up. That's not fun. Oh, can't dive here. Dive here. This is really easy to control. Yeah, I thought so. Oh. And the mighty salmon. <laughs> so now they're not giving you talismans because they don't matter anymore and the game goes fuck it you need orbs and that's that's the end of that and forget Talismans existed for the first, you know, like just a very inconsistent and strange choice. They were like, well, that's just a bit weird. Why would you choose to do that? Okay, fine. You know, it's very like, oh, say so. Luckily, I cleared out this space, so I'm not going to have to deal with weird platypuses. Oh, there's a man. 
like an actual man, like a human. Yeah, that one was always really hard. I remember that being a problem. The thing is, the game does this thing where it goes. See, that's, that's one of them now, though. Look at him, he's an asshole. These are a lot faster. See? That's just. And then it does that to you and just says, fuck off, now you die, cause fuck you. We're gonna just, triangle is cancel your jump. Triangle is also hover. We'll pick at random which one we'll choose. Right, okay, fuck you. You have to really hold it. Oh, he's back. Yeah, they're just assholes. They're assholes and they cause problems and I hate it and I just really don't like dealing with them. So I'm not gonna. Because, like I was saying, the game just says to you, by the way, you know we were giving you virtually no reason to pick up the orbs before? Yeah, now there's a reason. Fuck you. And then goes, here are the hardest challenges in the game. And it can be quite frustrating because it's like you're basically forced to backtrack anyway. But, um. Yeah. You're basically forced to backtrack. There's gems everywhere over there, man. Oh, or I thought there was. Huh. Anyone else see that glint there? Yeah, look. Oh. So you remember we saw that nest on the other side of, uh, for some reason? Yeah, so in the base game originally, it didn't give you much of a hint that the orbs were important other than that you're collecting them and it's a video game and you just go, oh, okay, so I probably need to, like, huh, you know? That was not a pencil. Oh, there was that weird shaking plant pot somewhere. Uh, yeah, and it doesn't really give you the impression, aside from you can collect them, therefore they're important. Until now, and then it goes, fuck you, wall. You should have been collecting them. And you're like, oh, I thought this was a, I'm only, I'm after 100%, you know? Shit. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, oh, oh, there's a springer in there. Spring. Gonna do the meat strat there. He gives you a duck. Don't know why, but he gives you a duck. So we go to where we saw the ducks. Ignore evil kangaroo man thing. You go to see the ducks. Take, the, take this duck, which we're holding in our mouths, so don't think about it too much. To the other ducks. They give us another thing, which is still not a pencil, and 
and I've actually lost track of where I'm supposed to be going now, so um, good work. I'm glad we had this. I'm sure I'll see some sort of ominous looking thing that's like, well, what is this? Kind of running low on battery though, so I kind of want to like get this over with. Um, yeah, and then it throws you, and like Robotica Farms is just, oh my god, fucking kill me levels of hard. Um, in terms of its like bonus choice stuff, you know, like the, the orb challenges. And it just makes you go, oh my fucking god, why? <laughs> you know what I mean? I feel like there was something up there. And that maybe there wasn't. Let's have a look at the tree houses quickly. Let me go a quick speedy look around. What even do we have? A turnip. Or a radish or something. A root vegetable of some kind. What does this do? This has to do something. Oh, fuck you. Is there any weird ground? He just goes in a circle. I'll catch in then. Oh, I won't. This is a fast bugger. I hit my turnip. Yeah. And it gives you the hardest challenges in the game and says, fuck you, do the hardest challenges in the game in your life. Oh. Oh, okay. The hard, okay. Great. Awesome. And you're just left to deal with, like, some of the most grueling challenges in the game at the last moment in your life. And, like, as a kid, you're like, oh, shit. Can I even get back to the original world or will that lose my progress? What, what happens there, you know? I put a turn it. Uh, I saw all the other shit and I haven't seen this one and I was looking around. I reckon it is something to do with that, you know. It's gotta be something up there because that's the only place I didn't really look hard. I'm probably wrong. Let's get this over with. Oh, shit. Great. Awesome. Well, I lost all that progress. Yep. Notice they got rid of the statues. The life statues from the first game, they just completely eradicated them. It's like, nah, they don't need to exist anymore, so they don't. And that was that. And that's all there was to it. I may give up on this and come back to it another day because it's just like I'm on like 16% battery on my laptop and I can't be asked to get up just to ruin the playthrough just so I can finish this dumb fetch quest when it's nearly like quarter to one in the morning. So like I've got shit to do. I'm supposed to be getting up tomorrow really early in the morning to look at this uh, 
house. Oh, what did I pick up again? What was next? Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah. There's this stuff down here. Yeah, I'm supposed to be getting up really early tomorrow. They were trying to make me come up at like nine in the morning to go look at other houses. Cause get this, I put down my deposit for a house. Uh, then they were like, oh yeah, the guy selling the apartment now doesn't want to sell it to you. And I'm like, oh great, I wonder if it's because of my race. And I was just like, oh, okay, fine, sure, whatever. Better give me back my deposit or that's a fucking scam. And they were like, oh, yeah, 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 and we can get you an apartment that's exactly the same in the same building because it's all new builds. So there's nobody there at the moment. So it's like there's loads of them up for sale, or up for rent and shit, and they're like, well, we'll just find you one that's identical. And they were going to do that tomorrow. And I'm like, yeah, okay, sure, and I'll just, if I find it. But I'm, like, kind of dubious that I'm going to be given an apartment that's like, we should do the best apartment. Here's a shit apartment, you know? There's still a gem there. There. I'm dubious that it'll be like... You know, we should do a good apartment. Here's one that looks the same, but actually has a load of problems with it, and we're not gonna fix them. But, you know, we sold you on the original one, so uh, <laughs> I'm really worried it'll be something like that. But, like, I mean, I won't know until tomorrow. I've got to get there. I knocked them down to 10.30 a.m. because I'm like, there's no way I was going to get there on time anyway. And it's, like, nearly 1 a.m. and I still haven't gone to sleep. So I'm sort of like, yeah, probably not in the best mood to be looking at houses and being ripped off. I don't know what I'm going to do if they, like give me really shit options, to be honest, because it's like I really like the apartment I was going to get. And um, they kind of fucked me on that. And they're like, oh, yeah, we'll find you one that's exactly the same. We're really sorry. And I'm like, there's a flower over there. I can't get it over there, can I? Nah, there's no way. Yeah, and I was just like, you know, I, I was really put out because they literally told me, like, the day, like, 9 p.m. today before I was supposed to see it, like, tomorrow morning and, like, write all of the papers up and pay the rest of the money for the apartment for the next six months. And I was just, like, real disappointed, to be honest, because I really had my eye on that apartment. No. Just thought I saw some funny-looking dirt. Uh, yeah, so very disappointing. I don't know who would want to turn up in this place. Yeah, I'm lost. Oh, uh, yeah, I might just call it a day. Fuck it. Uh, I'll have one more sweep around and then I'll look. Finish my story. <clears throat> yeah, I was a little disappointed that they're like, no, no, it's fine. We'll find you one that's exactly the same because, like I said, new build and shit. But I'm like, feels like you're trading me one for another kind of feels like you're fucking me that like you're pretending you're not but like it kind of feels like you're fucking me like you gave me this one I agreed to this one you're like okay cool you agreed to this one okay here's a worse one we're trading you for a worse one I'm thinking I'm too stupid to realize and it's just like don't know if I feel great about that but like we'll see we'll see you know all the flowers are everywhere so it's not that um fucking lost on this. Oh, more gems. Look at all the gems. There we go. That's something, right? No. Uh, I'm probably being stupid and there's a very obvious place I'm supposed to be putting it, but I'll just look at the walk through and then come back to this tomorrow after I can finish this story that I'm talking about right now and see if they fuck me. Because, uh, yeah, I'm pretty annoyed about it, but it's like, you know, they said, wait, no, no, uh, 
because they said that they'd help me out on this, and I'm just like, if they're going to just keep screwing me over, I don't really know what I'm going to do. Maybe I can give this to the, the plant man. Maybe he wants it. I don't know why he'd want it, but you, you know. I, I'm not to judge. Maybe he likes turnips. He does not care. You know, I just uh, don't want to get fucked over and uh, kind of disappointing because, yeah, like I said, but if they got ones that are exactly the same and they are exactly the same, maybe there was something wrong with that apartment, you know? Maybe they don't, they don't want to tell me because it's like, oh, shit, it'll deter him. Maybe it's like, you know, there's something wrong with that apartment, like something happened, something broke in there, and they were like, oh, we can't sell him this. He's signing the papers tomorrow. And they just thought, fine, we'll just shift it somewhere else. But, like, that doesn't make me feel much better either, you know? Wait, there's an area down here. Oh, there's nothing here, though. Right, I'm going to call this a day. Fuck it. Uh, I need to sleep anyway. Maybe he wants it. He does not. Bye-bye. And we'll call that a day. I'll come back to it tomorrow with more news. Oh look, an ending cutscene. I don't even know what these guys are. I always thought they were like weird goat muppet people. <laughs> they need to fire that sleepy wizard. Uh, see you tomorrow. I may be angry. I may be hangry. I may be hungover. So that makes me hungangry. Yeah. <laughs>